फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन ऑफ एक्सरसाइज 24 ए द मंथली इनकम ऑफ अ फैमिली इज रुपीज ट्वेंटी द मंथली एक्सपेंडिचर ऑफ द फैमिली ऑन वेरियस आइटम्स इज गिवन बिलो रिप्रेजेंट अबाउट डाटा इन पाई चार्ट एंड देयर एक्सपेंडिचर्स आर गिवन रेंट इज 8000 फूड एक्सपेंसेस फूड एक्सपेंसेस आर 10800 क्लोथिंग एक्सपेंसेस आर 5600 एजुकेशन 3600 एंड सेविंग 800 एंड वी हैव टू रिप्रेजेंट ऑल दिस डाटा इन पाई चार्ट सो फर्स्ट स्टेप टू ड्रॉ पाई चार्ट इज कैलकुलेट सेंट्रल एंगल फॉर अ कंपोनेंट सो वी हैव दैट फॉर्मूला दैट सेंट्रल एंगल फॉर अ कंपोनेंट इज इक्वल्स टू वी कैन राइट सेंट्रल एंगल फॉर कंपोनेंट एंड दिस फॉर्मूला इज इक्वल्स टू वैल्यू ऑफ द कंपोनेंट upon total value of all components multiply by 360 degree so now the total value of all the components here total value of all the expenditure is equals to total value of all the components so we have to find sum of all the expenditure so sum of all the expenditure is equals to Uh, it is eight thousand plus ten thousand eight hundred plus fifty six hundred plus thirty six hundred plus eight hundred. So you have to add them, and their sum is equals to twenty eight thousand eight hundred. now we will find value o of central angle angle for a component so to calculate central angle for a component we have to draw one table and the table uh, we will make like this uh, first is item second is uh, your expenditure in rupees and then third one will be your central angle and now first item is rent second item is food third item is clothing fourth item is education and fifth item is saving so the expenditures we are given uh, we are uh, so rent is 8000 rupees and food is 10800 clothing is 5600 education is 3600 and saving is equals to 800 and uh, uh, you can add their their values so it will come uh, 28800 now we have to find value of central angle so first you have to find central angle for rent so we will put the values in the formula so the formula is value of the component on total value of all the components so value of component value of rent is given 8000 divided by total value of all the components means total expenditure and total expenditure is equals to 28800 multiply by 360 degree so from here we can calculate from here we can calculate the value of central angle and the value is Hundred degree. Next, we will calculate uh, central angle for food, and the central angle for food is uh, the value of the component is given. Value of the food is given. Expenditure of the food is given. It is ten thousand eight hundred. Multiply by uh, the total expenditure is given. It is twenty eight thousand eight hundred. Multiply by it is three sixty. so you can find value and it will come 135 degree next we will find uh, central angle for clothing and the uh, expenditure on clothing is given 
टोटल एक्सपेंडिचर इज गिवन ट्वेंटी मल्टीप्लाई बाई थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी इफ यू कैलकुलेट दिस इट विल कम सेवेंटी डिग्री नाउ वी विल फाइंड सेंट्रल एंगल फॉर एजुकेशन एंड द एक्सपेंडिचर ऑन एजुकेशन इज थर्टी सिक्स हंड्रेड डिवाइडेड बाई टोटल एक्सपेंडिचर इज गिवन टोटल एक्सपेंडिचर इज ट्वेंटी एट थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड मल्टीप्लाई बाई थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी डिग्री इज इक्वल्स टू इज इक्वल्स टू फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री देन वी विल फाइंड सेंट्रल एंगल फॉर सेविंग एंड सेविंग इज गिवन एट हंड्रेड रुपीज डिवाइडेड बाई टोटल एक्सपेंडिचर एंड टोटल एक्सपेंडिचर इज ट्वेंटी एट थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड मल्टीप्लाई बाई थ्री सिक्सटी सो इट विल कम टेन डिग्री सो फ्रॉम फ्रॉम दिस फॉर्मूला वी कैन फाइंड सेंट्रल एंगल फॉर ईच कंपोनेंट नाउ सेंट्रल एंगल फॉर रेंट इज हंड्रेड डिग्री फॉर फूड इट इज वन हंड्रेड थर्टी फाइव डिग्री फॉर क्लोथिंग इट इज सेवेंटी डिग्री फॉर एजुकेशन इट इज फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री एंड फॉर सेविंग इट इज टेन डिग्री सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू चेक वेदर यूर कैलकुलेशन वेदर यूर सेंट्रल एंगल्स आर राइट और रॉन्ग सो यू कैन एड दैम इफ देर सम इज इक्वल्स टू थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी डिग्री दैट मीन्स योर कैलकुलेशन इज राइट एंड इफ इट इज नॉट इक्वल्स टू थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी दैन यू हैव टू चेक अगेन नाउ वी विल ड्रॉ द सेंट्रल एंगल वी विल ड्रॉ द पाई चार्ट Uh, with the help of central angle and uh, for this for this we will draw a circle of any suitable radius so so this is how we can draw a circle and then next step was to draw a horizontal line in your circle so this is horizontal line now we will start from here and uh, the total central angle for rent was 100 degree so at the at here we will draw a angle of 100 degree so this is your protector and with the help of protector you can draw an angle of 100 degree so it will come here so now we will join this point with the center so we can draw a line like this now this is 100 degree angle and this sector this sector will represent expenses on uh, rent so we can write here rent then second is Uh, expenses on second was expenditure on food and uh, we got its angle equals to 135 degree so now we will draw an angle of 135 degree over this line so for this yes now it is 130 it is 140 so we will draw 135 degree here now we can join this line this point with the center so now this is how we can join so now this sector will represent expenditure on food then you can also write their angles it is 100 degree rent was 100 degree and food is 135 degree then next is clothing expenditure on clothing and it was 70 degree so we will draw a angle of 70 degree here now it is food so we will draw a line we will draw an angle at here it is 70 so now this is how we get one point we can mark one point and we will join this line with center so this is 70 degree and this is for clothing next is education and education was 45 degree so we can draw angle of 45 degree so it is 40 and it is 50 so we can draw angle here then we will join this line with center this this, this point with center so now this is 45 degree and this is for education 
and this remainder this remainder angle is for saving and it will come 10 degree if we will measure this and it is equals to 10 degree so this is 10 degree for saving now you can uh, shade different different reasons uh, with different different designs like you can hatch in one part and you can add uh, you can mark like plus sign in some portion and you can you can separate all these sectors with different different designs like uh, you can make any kind of design in the sectors so so to differentiate them now we will write down uh, its steps so steps you can write in your own language also and whatever you have done to draw this diagram you have to write all those things in your steps so now we will write steps so first step was first step was uh, the measurement of uh, uh, central angle so we have we calculated central angle so in step number one we can write calculate central angle using formula step number two was uh, we draw one circle so we can write draw a circle of so draw a suit circle with suitable radius then third was draw a horizontal line and yeah, draw a horizontal radius then in step number four we make uh, uh, different different central angles so you can write draw central angles draw uh, uh, central angles corresponding to the item corresponding to the respective item or respective component so you can write respective component also and uh, last step was shade different different reason shade different different sectors So this is how you can write some steps. Uh, this is how you can write steps, uh, or you can write all these steps in your own language also.